Welcome back all of my king and queens. It is queen of queens she me. And first I want to start off by saying hello to all of my new subscribers. Welcome to the family. And to all of my current subscribers who have been with me either the last few months or over the last almost two years of my YouTube journey. Welcome back as well. So the video that I have for you guys today is all about my updated skincare routine. Without further ado, we're going to go right on ahead and get into this video. Alright queens, so first we're going to start out by washing our hands. I find that this is very critical when you're getting ready to wash your face. Then we're just going to dampen our face. I usually just use lukewarm water and as you guys can see, my skin has been clearing up and I have only had minimal breakouts. I've been using this Dermaclear Microphone Cleanser from Dr. Jart and literally it's a miracle in a bottle, like no lie. I love how it feels, I love the scent, I like the fact that you only have to use actually like a dime size amount. So you're just going to massage this in your hands until you get a light lather and then once you massage it into the skin as you can see it really does begin to foam. So we're going to go in using the Origins Clear Improvement Active Charcoal Mask and this has been a ride or die for the whole 2016 and so I'm bringing it with me into 2017. And I mean, I let it dry for about 20 to 30 minutes and then I just simply go in by rinsing my face using cold water. That has made a significant difference as well in my skincare regimen. It also helps to keep my pores small versus using lukewarm where it would open back up my pores. So yeah, you guys, my face has really been clearing up. I'm loving the results and I've been actually using this facial cleanser for only about two weeks. So um, going back to 2016, these two are my holy grails, the Josie Moran 100% Argan Oil and the Tarte Maracuja Oil. So I'm just simply going to take a full dropper and I only do that at night. And as you can see, it really is a lightweight oil. And then I'm just going to massage this into my hands until it gets a little warm and then massage that into the skin. And you just really want to make sure that you do this immediately after you wash your face. So that way the oil can really penetrate the skin. And you just want to make sure you massage this in. Don't forget your neck area. So now we're going to go in with the lip treatment. This is the Glam Glow. Um, pout mud it's pretty much a lip balm but it has little granules in it and I like how it, it makes my lips feel really soft moisturized and it really does make a difference on my lips because the winter months have just really been crucial for me so that's pretty much it for my skincare routine that's all that I've really done so now we're just gonna go right on back into further detail now that you actually see what it is that I do for my updated skincare routine I kind of wanted to go in depth a little bit more as to how each product actually works for my specific skin type my skin type is primarily oily but it can also be combination um, as well recently I have been using the Dermaclear Microfoam um, cleanser and it is from Dr. Jart and you guys have seen me use Dr. George's products before in the past and I currently still use his products to this day. When I tell you that you literally only need about a dime size amount to actually just wash your face, I'm not lying to you. This product retails at Sephora for $23 and it's for perfect and it is perfect for cleansing with fine bubbles it, it has a purifying effect of hydrogen mineral water it's a mild and moisturizing formula and this is dermatologist dermatologist tested dr jar is affordable for everybody so i'm just going to show you guys pretty much what the formula I don't looks like it all the way out but that's what it looks like it's a white cleanser so I have been using this day and night. I have been using this for the last two weeks. So I was actually using this going into the new year. And you guys, if you saw in the previous footage, my face has cleared up so much. 
Um, a lot of the scars are still there from my acne, but for the most part, I have cystic acne. And what that means is that my acne doesn't typically come to a head as soon as a lot of people may have their acne breakouts. For me, mine tend to start underneath the skin and then over the next few days, if I'm not paying attention or washing my face day and night or even using a mask, it will come to a head and it will be really big, but you necessarily can't get to it because it's underneath the skin. So that is like the worst acne to ever have. And I'm an adult now and I still battle with acne. And ever since I've been using this Dermaclear from Dr. Jart, I'm not lying to you guys. My face has had very minimal breakouts. Like I've only had one here and then I've had one here, but for the most part, I don't have daily breakouts like I typically do. Okay, so now that I've shown you guys pretty much the cleansers that I have been using, I have been using the Origins Clear Improvement Active Charcoal Mask to Clear Pores. And this is the actual, I'm going to call this like a medium size because the larger size is about $26 and this one was only I believe $14 or $17 and you can actually pick this up like when you're getting ready to check out at Sephora. So I love, love, love Origins. Let me just start off by saying that I love Dr. Jart but you guys when I tell you that I love Origins, I love their mask, I just love everything that they have. They're inexpensive, they're very effective, and they're perfect for people who have oily the combination skin, I promise. So again, this is from Origins, and it's their Clear Improvement Charcoal Mask. Along with using the Active Charcoal Mask from Origins, I've also been using their Original Skin Retexturizing Clay Mask in Rose Clay. Okay, so this is what the packaging looks like, you guys. And again, this is their Rose Clay Mask, and I love this stuff. This is perfect for like texture. So um, again, these have been my, my holy grail. I have been using these again for over a year now, so I can definitely swear by this and let you guys know that this is definitely perfect for people who have oily to combination skin now as far as what I use to moisturize my skin I used to use an actual like cream moisturizer you guys but cream moisturizers just weren't cutting it primarily when I moisturize my skin it's either with an oil or a serum and it's primarily with just using oils and I know it sounds crazy because yes I have oily skin and I'm using the oil to moisturize my skin but with using an oil it helps to keep your skin from overproducing its own natural oil or aka sebum sebum is nothing more than a natural the natural oils that come from out of your skin is no different than the oils that come from off of your scalp that is called sebum and that is coming from your own so body. the two oils that i have been switching between for the last year or so is the tart maracuja oil and then the other one is the Josie Moran 100% Pure Argon Oil. These are my Holy Grail facial serums for oily skin. And we're going to start with the Tarte Maracuja Oil. This container right here, this one is um, $16 I believe. Interesting it because I don't use that much of it. I only use as much as I need. So again, in the morning times, I only use about four to five drops. And then at night, I'll use a whole actual dropper. So, okay, so that is pretty much what it looks like. And I just love this freaking oil. It's a lightweight oil, you guys. And it just works phenomenal. I just love how it makes my skin feel. And it also does have a nice scent. The as next well. oil that I just showed you guys is the Josie Moran 100% Pure Argon Oil. Now this little guy right here, I actually get him with my Sephora points. The full size, I believe, is either $42 or $52 as well. And yeah, this is so small, and I get this using my Sephora points. And it's only 100 points every time. And then this is the oil itself. So as you can see, it's just a lightweight oil as well. And that's actually what I use today to moisturize my face. So let me zoom you guys in so you can actually see what my skin looks okay, like. Okay, so this is what my face looks like. And again, this has been since I've been using the Dr. Jart Derma um, Clear Microphone Cleanser, you guys. And my face has just been so much better. And yeah, so that's pretty much what I use 
for moisturizing my face after I have cleansed it using the Derma Clear Microphone Cleanser. All right, and last but not least, the last two items I wanna share with you guys is pretty much what I use to take off my makeup, and that is very important as well. What you use to take off your makeup can either make or break your skincare, so you have to be very careful when you're applying your makeup as well as when you're taking off of taking off your makeup as well. So as you guys know, I use my Tahitian Sunset Organic Coconut Oil and I get this all the time from Burlington, but recently I found a new place where I can find unrefined coconut oil for the exact same price. This is not unrefined, but it still gets the job done. So you guys will be seeing a new coconut oil soon. But this is what I use to actually take my makeup off with. This is what I use to pre-poo. This is what I use to seal my hair. This is what I use when my hands are dry. Coconut oil is bae. So yeah, I use just like a um, tablespoon amount. I massage it on my hands and then I massage it onto my face. And then all my makeup just melts and then I just use my Petal Fresh Botanicals Makeup Removing Cleansing Towelettes. And these are in the rose, um, yeah, this is from the Rose Collection. And this is for toning and balancing. So I have this to actually moisturize, but also to remove the makeup from my skin. And then I have the facial wipes that are gentle, but they're also for toning and balancing my skin. So these two together, they are just like the perfect combination for my oily two combinations. The benefits yeah. of natural oils, the list just goes on, you guys. So, and also too, if you have not seen my top 10 favorite essential um, oils video, I will definitely link that up above for you guys so you can get some education on natural oils and the benefits of using them on um, not just your hair, but also your skin All as right, well. you guys, so this is the end of the video. And the last item that I wanted to share with you guys was something that I just recently, not discovered but finally decided to purchase and this is the glam glow wet lip balm treatment and this is the pout mud and this is what it looks like it's just a small this is a small one now this is the one in the ornament size so I only paid $14 for this one and I know you guys are like I know damn well you didn't pay $14 a lip treatment yes i did because it was time to just invest in a really good lip treatment because me and my baby we like to kiss and do all that good jazz and don't nobody want to kiss anybody with some nasty old crusty ass lips that is just not cute <laughs> and so this is what the inside looks like and i just like the way that it makes my lips feel oh my gosh and it just goes into your lips like butter and it has like some form of like little granules or something but they dissolve right into the lips and they just make your lips really soft and it has like a tingly sensation all right you guys so that's pretty much it for my updated skincare routine for pretty much winter 2017 i would say i guess i don't even know what i'm gonna call this video you guys but it's just my updated skincare routine and i've just noticed such a big difference in my skin and i wanted to share it with you guys because i know if you're like me and you're dealing with you know cystic acne and you have oily skin the struggle is real okay and i feel your pain honey i feel your pain so let me help you ease your pain with what i've been using to help clear up my skin as well I hope you guys enjoyed this video, my king and queens. If you did, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. That's the only way I know if you like this content that I'm putting out for you guys. And then as well, please comment down below. Let me know if you tried any of these products that I shared with you guys today. Because I know some of you probably have. And then if you're like me at the beginning when I didn't know what the hell I was trying to do. When I was trying to create a skincare regimen. Uh, yeah, you may not have tried any of these things. So just sound off down below in the comment section. And then also too, the main thing is I want you to subscribe. Subscribe to my channel. Come on, join the family so that we all can continue to grow together. Again, I'm gonna have a whole bunch of new content coming you guys this way. So I just wanna make sure that you're not missing out. That's pretty much it. So I love each and every one of you. Thank you for spending your time with me today and I'll see you guys in my next upload. Be blessed.